Have you ever wondered how much an asteroid could be worth? Picture this, a treasure trove floating in the vast expanse of space, rich with resources that could change the face of our planet's economy. This isn't just the stuff of science fiction, but a burgeoning field of interest known as asteroid mining. Just imagine, asteroids, these seemingly insignificant specks in our cosmic backyard, hold untold wealth in precious metals and rare minerals. But how do we measure their worth? Let's take a step back in time to the early 19th century, when the first ever asteroid, Ceres, was discovered. This colossal object, the biggest in the asteroid belt, was a beacon of our understanding of these celestial bodies. However, despite its impressive size, Ceres is not necessarily the most valuable. While Ceres holds a place of importance in the history of asteroid discovery, it's not where the real treasure lies. To find the real riches, we have to turn to a later discovery, the asteroid 16 Psyche. Named after the Greek goddess of the soul, this celestial body was first spotted in the mid-19th century, in the year 1852, to be precise. What makes 16 Psyche truly extraordinary is not its size or its distance from us, but its composition. Unlike most asteroids which are made of rock or ice, 16 Psyche is made almost entirely of precious metals. It's a gigantic nugget of gold, platinum and nickel floating in the abyss of space. NASA has recognized the immense potential value of this asteroid and has plans to send a mission to study it up close. And when we say immense, we're talking astronomical. If we could somehow mine 16 Psyche and bring its riches back to Earth, it might make us all billionaires. But it's not the only valuable rock out there. Let's turn our eyes to the asteroid 55 Pandora, a diamond in the rough. This intriguing chunk of celestial rock was discovered back in the mid-19th century, in the year 1858 to be precise. But why are we interested in this seemingly ordinary asteroid? The answer lies in its composition. 55 Pandora is classified as a carbonaceous asteroid, a type of asteroid rich in complex organic compounds. But that's not all. This diamond in the rough could also be teeming with the most precious resource for future space explorers, water. Imagine a reservoir of life-sustaining water floating in the void of space. But the potential of 55 Pandora doesn't stop at water. It could also contain other organics, resources that could be used to sustain life or even to fuel interstellar travel. The potential value of this asteroid is staggering. 55 Pandora could be a lifesaver for future space explorers, but there's one more asteroid that outshines them all. The asteroid 241 Germania, discovered in 1884, is a platinum-rich rock with an estimated worth that could collapse our economy. This metallic asteroid, nestled in the main asteroid belt between Mars and Jupiter, is unlike any other. Composed primarily of platinum, iron and nickel, it's a celestial treasure chest. If we could mine it, the value of this asteroid would be so immense that it could destabilize our global economy. Yet the concept of mining asteroids isn't as simple as it sounds. There are countless logistical, technical and ethical challenges to overcome. From the high costs and risks of space travel, to the technological advancements needed for mining in zero gravity, and the potential environmental impact of bringing these extraterrestrial resources back to Earth. While these asteroids hold unimaginable wealth, they also represent a new frontier in space exploration and a testament to the endless potential of our universe. As we continue to explore the cosmos, these celestial bodies remind us of the infinite opportunities and challenges that await us.